Yahweh well, coming back again with another lesson. Giving all praises on and glory to Yahweh. Baha Shem Yahweh Shai. Baha Shem Racha HaKadash. Double honor to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone. And shalom on to the hopeful elect brothers that believe in this word and their fear and the heavenly father and his son. You know, um, it's just a, a video in this, uh, you know, that, that came to me uh, as I was uh, listening to a song on the radio. Um, and, uh, basically, I, I, I forget the uh, the name of the artist, but uh, she's she's in the song um, singing about how she just <laughs> K I L L her uh, her her ex man so to speak, right? Which is wicked. That's a wicked oh, with a wicked ass song, right? And they, they pushing that vibration out, out out here through these. Uh, these women uh, to encourage other women to do wickedness. Now, as I'm listening to it on the radio, this on the on the public airways radio, or whatever, right? That the word K I L L, right, is being censored, right? So you notice that a lot of brothers, we try. It is it's fucking ridiculous that you know. But like the scripture said, they'll they'll make a, a man an offender for a word, right? They're they're putting all these uh, uh, um, restrictions on what you can say um, to to basically uh, make it make it eat harder for you to say certain things or come out with certain truth to be more direct, right? So now you know brothers be having to speak in code. You know, sometimes you get angry and just say to hell with it and you just use the word anyway, right? Um, you know, uh, brothers are you know, saying deleted, unalive, you know, I, I say I say destroyed, give up the ghost. You, we know what that means. It's a, it's a simple word we can use for a KI, uh, you know, uh, or, or, or even anything dealing with K-I-L-L, D-E-A, T-H, you know, they're, they're censoring, they're censoring these words even on the radio. Now, I don't know if they're doing it with all these others, but th that was censored. I'm like, hold on. All she's saying is K-I-L-L. -L. You know, she's saying, she, I just, I just K-I-L-L -L my ex. I'm like, they're just censoring that now? <laughs> I'm like, that, that, you know, so that just, that just brought to mind this, you know. And, you know, the family of the word uh, uh, will come. Of course, we, we have to, uh, we got other prophecies <clears throat> that are going to be, you know, uh, uh, coming up. Now, what, whether or not uh, the famine comes right before the uh, the MOTB, or the MOTB comes right before, you know, the, 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 the famine of the world, which, you know, that may be the more likely situation. Because once once things are made mandatory, this devil is gonna come down with force, and then really is gonna get to the point where we're gonna be apprehended, and it's gonna be harder for us to move around in, in the public, so to speak, right? So it, it wouldn't wouldn't even be wise to go out on the um, on the uh, highways and the byways to preach, seeing that they're gonna have bounty hunters and you know different agents and even the common people they're gonna put a you know have a reward on that head so to speak you know they're gonna flash our our, our faces across the, the tv screen all for all for preaching the all for preaching the truth of the bible right and really we're preaching the truth all right so for the for the peace all right of of, of israel all right, which that will be the kingdom. All right, the, the the kingdom of heaven is the kingdom of the Israelites, right? So we're preaching the truth that uh, you know that we may have peace. But what comes with us having peace, right, and having a righteous kingdom? What comes with us having peace and having a righteous kingdom, right? War, evil. And pestilence has to come upon the earth before we can have peace as a nation 
and the earth can be at peace and the animals all creation be at peace there has to be war and turmoil or war evil and, and pestilence as it says in jeremiah about 8 and 28 oh my bad 28 and 8 i get that mixed up right so that has that has to come you know right now we're warring it's it's the uh it's the truth against lies. So we're warring in the spirit. It's a battle for the mind, right? But then things are gonna become physical to where they're gonna wanna lay hands on us. Just as they did with our Lord Yahweh, right? And you notice that there was a point where it was a battle of, of, uh, uh, of imagination, so to speak. It was a battle in the spirit, imaginations. All right, that's why you, you had a lot of uh, different wicked Israelites that would come up to the Lord and try to entangle him and what he was saying to get him hemmed up. Right? And then it came to the point where they actually uh, laid hands on him and apprehended him and, and brought, brought up a false witness. So they're going to do the same thing unto us. But they're trying to restrict us from saying the truth. You know, and that's, you know, we got uh, alternative. Um, uh, channels like uh, Odyssey and Daily Motion and uh, what's that? Uh, I believe it's uh, is it Bit Bit Shoot, right? You know, which all all the videos that you see on my channel, they they automatically get uploaded to Odyssey. Uh, and Lord, well, I'll I'll, uh, I'll redo a, a video for my Odyssey channel and uh, either make a post or do a video on it when I do videos on Odyssey. But that's what you can you know. You can use those alternative platforms to do these controversial topics and to not use a, a, a filter, so to speak, right? That the, these devils are trying to filter the, the direct, raw truth, you know? But, you know, it, it's, it's gonna come to the point where you can't say certain things against, against this devil or <laughs> you'll, you'll be deleted. <laughs> but which that would be what that'd be like uh, draconian law. You know, you see it in all these different apocalyptic movies, right? They call them apocalyptic movies, end time movies. What's the word apocalyptic? Or apocalypse means um, it means it basically goes back into a, a, a revelation, right? A, a revealing of something. Like you got uh, uh, the apoc the apocrypha, right? The apo means uh, 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 and I'll, I'll have to I'll have to get the uh, the etymology on it. But basically, it, it basically goes into being hidden, right? And in the sense, but with the ap 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 apocalypse in the Greek, it's apocalypses, right? Which goes into things being unveiled or revealed. Okay, things being shown. So when you watch these different apocalyptic movies, all right, a lot of that, a lot of that stuff goes back into the scriptures, right? That's where the inspiration is drawn to create these movies, right? But it also reveals what it, it reveals some of the plans of what this devil is going to do. And also, since a lot of it is inspired by prophecies of the scriptures, it gives you a depiction how things are going to be and of course they they work things up in there you know you, you take it with a grain of salt you eat the meat and spit out the bones but they reveal a lot of things they're going to do in their different movies and tv series right so you know like i said it's the in-transit impromptu man just wanted to uh, say something in the spirit but i just i just noticed that like dang why are they why are they uh, uh censoring which if they if they did were censoring that word before and I just did because I don't listen to the radio. You know, I like to uh, control what I listen to. But um, control what goes into my ears. But out, outside of that, yeah man, they're gonna you know there's gonna be a family of the word they already put in restricting that's uh they're already putting restrictions on what you can say, right? 
That's why we use all these different codes, man. Decepticons and this and that. And then, <laughs> what was surprised me is these devils figured out, well, what are they talking about, right? They figured out everything that we're talking about, but really, they, they, they do all these things through um, algorithms, algorithms. So, algorithms that um, monitor what you're saying, your speech, whatever. That's hard. It's harder when you're using a code that they haven't, um, they haven't, uh, you know, framed the algorithm to 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 uh, give you a strike for using a particular word that they use everywhere else. Like for example, Decepticon. You know, Decepticons from Transformers. You watch the Transformer movie. They're gonna, they're gonna they're gonna ban that. It's a Transformer movie, right? Everybody watch that. They monetizing that. Right? So but they, they do everything through their algorithms, man. And that's how this that's how you know this devil uh seeks to control um the masses of the people is through his technology. That's how he seeks to be like the most high through his technology. So you know, um just wanted to do a quick uh in transit on that. Go go, I'm gonna come back with another video with some scriptures. So go go you had a problem with that, I'm gonna say show.